Hi everyone, welcome to today's video. Today we will learn about placement of standard cells further. In previous video we have already seen the introduction to placement stage in which we briefly saw about what is done there before placement. Then we also discussed about various different placement strategies. Now let us further deep dive into placement. So far we have discussed about different placement strategies and after that we also discussed about components of placement optimization. We also learned about how tool will do the placement and that is it will do the course placement and then it will do det detail placement and today we will see furthermore what happens in the place of. In this video we are trying to understand what actually happens in the placement and optimization stage. So first that step happens is your initial placement in the place opt stage. So initial placement we have already seen that it is course placement in the initial place. So what tool does in initial place is it will take the approximate location and then it will try to place it. So it will not do the legalization. No legalization will happen here. So you will not see the cell properly placed. It will be overlapping and after that you can also say that it is doing scan chain optimization in this stage scan chain what optimization of scan chain is we will see that in the next video for now you can see that this is one thing that happens in the place opt stage in the initial place of place opt and then after that it will also try to do the buffer aware timing play, timing driven placement so buffer aware placement it will do yeah me, which means that if there is any buffer needed to meet the timing and if it is seeing that cells are placed far, it will try to insert the buffer to meet the timing. So you can say that buffer aware timing driven placement is done here in this particular stage. So this is what happens in the initial, op, initial place. After that, the second stage is your initial DRC stage. These There are total five stages of place opt which we are discussing here so this is your initial drc stage in the initial drc it will do the high fan out net buffering high fan out nets which are there in the design they will be buffered so scan chain is one hfn or you can say one high fan out net but it is always having the highest priority so irrespective of other high fan out nets which are in their design scan chain will always be there so that is why we will do scan chain buffering first in the initial place itself but if there are other high, high fan out nets then tool will do the hfn buffering in this particular stage so what it will do is it will remove existing buffer tree so removal of buffer tree is done in the first stage and then it will do after that it will do hfn that is high fan out net synthesis so why it is done is because the the high fan out nets means you have fan out of more than 100 it will consider that and net as a high fan out net so there will be nets in the design which are more than 100 so it will consider that as a high fan out net that constraint you can specify in the constraints file with the constraint of max fan out with the max fan out you can specify the number based on that number whatever number uh, whatever the fan out of the net is it will decide whether it is a high fan out or not not and based on that it will do the high fan out net synthesis in this particular stage and then after that next it will do is logical drc fixing logical drc is nothing but it is also a fan out fixing and other which are called also called as drvs which we have discussed already in the one of the previous videos what is logical drc is nothing but your drvs that is design rule violations it includes your max fan out fixing it includes max cap fixing and it also includes max tran fixing these all things are fixed in this particular stage so if you have any capacitance load on a net which is high it will try to fix it if you have any transition violation in the input pins it will also try to fix it so these all things happen in the initial drc stage now the third step in the place opt stage is called as initial opto 
in the initial opto stage what tool does is it will very quickly do the timing optimization since it has done some drv fixing based on that there would be timing violations which are new and it will try to quickly fix those violations after that fourth stage is called as final place so final place is a stage where tool does incremental timing driven optimization incremental timing driven optimization so what happens is in the previous timing optimization stage if something is left incrementally it will try to fix and it will also try to fix global route congestion so gr congestion you can say so if you have congestion because of cell density is high or some pen density is high or any other cause because of which congestion could be coming up so it will try to quickly do the global route congestion fixing or you can say global route congestion driven placement so global route congestion driven placement it will try to do and also it will try to fix some scan related violations so scan optimization also happens here and then after that last stage is your final opt stage where finally it will try to do the leftover timing violations it will fix and it will also do the legalization so legalization also happens here these this is the most important stage where most of the remaining timing violation fix so that is why after the final opto you will try you will always be seeing some good amount of timing timing is fixed here is a quick review for the place opt stage that we have done so it is done in five different stages and first stage is initial place first stage is your initial place and after that it does initial drc and after that it will do initial opto and after initial opto it will do final place and after final place it will do final opto so these are five different stages which we have seen today in the place opt stage previously we have discussed the different strategies that is timing driven congestion driven these strategies can be utilized based on the app options that are available in the tool so based on that it will try to do the place opt stage which are different stages which we described here in fact in there are further more concepts related to the placement that we can discuss in the further videos that's all for this video please do like share and subscribe to the channel thank you